how hard is it to do everyday activities inside of a moving box trailer? And with me are seven of my friends. So I thought, let's divide up into teams and make this a competition. So we have the A team and team team. And here's how this is gonna work. We set up a track in a giant empty lot, complete with sharp turns, straightaways, and sudden stops. Round one challenges are easy, round two medium, and round three hard. After the players from each team randomly select their challenges, they have a certain amount of time in the trailer to complete it. If one succeeds and one fails, the one who fails goes home. On the other hand, if they both win or lose, they have to select a tiebreaker challenge to see who goes home. And finally, after the third round, the winning team will be determined, and the losing team has to go around the track three times in complete darkness. And to see who goes first, the teams played oh, rock, man. paper, scissors. Oh man, it's getting intense. Oh my gosh! Oh. So you guys are up. You guys have to nominate someone to go first. Susanna! Alright, first challenge. Count to 100. Oh. Oh, okay. What? You think she thinks she's gonna be able to do that? You better count fast. This is gonna be fun. It sounds easy, but it's not, because I'm gonna drive pretty fast. We're ready to go. I'm going to slowly drive over to the starting point, and I'll give you a countdown. Susanna just brought home a win for you guys. How do you feel? How do you feel? Who's going to do this challenge? You? you? Kelsey, pick a challenge. Heck yeah. What is it? Untie entire team. Three, two, one. Ready? Go. Going. Kels, you brought home a win. Yes, I did. You tied both your shoes. All right, Susanna, choose your tiebreaker challenge. First person to find hidden item. In the dark. <laughs> this challenge is different. They're both in the trailer searching for a metal spoon in the pitch black dark. This is my infrared camera, and I had to record it with my phone because it wasn't working at the moment. As you can see, it is pitch black in here. You, you, they can't see anything. Will it be above us? I don't know. <sighs> All right, you start, you start in the truck. I'm terrified. Took home the win, Kelsey. <laughs> go home. Bye. Get out. It's time to get started on round two. Woo! Let's go! Nate, all right, pick it. Write a letter half length of a page. Oh, <laughs> Nate, here's your clipboard. Are you wearing a helmet, dude? Nah. No protection. No protection. No protection. Oh, oh, okay. Kind of okay. worried. You have to pick a teammate to write about. I'm gonna write about my friend Jared here and how he better not lose the hard competition. Oh, yeah. it's gotta be at least half a page. All right. All right. Oh, 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 and another thing. Yeah. It has to be less cool. Less cool. Oh, okay. One, two, three. First turn. Second turn, the big wide one. Sign it! Sign it! Almost halfway through the second. Third. 
Dude, I can't believe you wrote half a page. Um, let's see if Jared can read it. He has to read at least 75%. This is very heartfelt. Can, can, can you read it though? <laughs> Dear Jared, do not lose oh? the next competition. I need you to. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, you guys took the L, but you can still win because they might lose a challenge. In which case, another tiebreaker is on the mix. Pick so. a challenge, Becca. Solve this algebra problem. Yeah! yeah! Becca, are you nervous? Yes, sir. Are you good at math? Yes. Colby, are we ready? Three, two, one, going. And Nate, you're almost legible. We need another tiebreaker challenge. All right, Nate and Becca, step forward. Who can stay on the bed the longest? During this challenge, you had to stay on this air mattress without using your feet or hands against the walls or floor to stay on it. All right, three, two, one. <laughs> That's one lap. <laughs> Nate was actually holding on much better than I thought he would. So by the second lap, we just decided to stop and see what Becca could do. He lasted almost two minutes. Well, Becca, are you ready? I don't know. You pretty scared? No. Yeah, he's going body slam against this wall. I know, I died. So ideally, you didn't, you didn't want me to do this. I really like it. I'm terrified. <laughs> Yeah, it would be. Three, two, one. Ah! Rebecca, you can your leg to stay on. No! That's it, that's it. <laughs> what did I use my leg? You used your leg, your whole leg went up the wall. So here's the deal, here's the deal. Okay. Her mattress came over here, right? To stay on, she did one of these. Okay, okay, I know what you're thinking. That didn't count. She clearly didn't touch the wall. And yes, you're right. Colby made a bad call. Unfortunately, we didn't review the footage. But I do think Nate was just glued to his mattress. So he would have lasted forever anyway. Becca, I'm sorry. Leave. Josh, you're the only one holding your team. You have the power to take this... <laughs> <laughs> With Josh being the last man standing on Team Team, Jerry was A Team's nominee for the third round. You guys done this, dude? Hard stuff. Hard stuff. Pick your challenge, Josh. Pick your challenge. Pour a pitcher of water. Oh. But here's the thing: you can't drop any water. You might lose this one. It's a it's a hard challenge. Yeah. But here's the thing, okay? If you lose, if I lose. It doesn't really matter how much water is on the floor. Okay. Oh dang. You have to fill this cup up, okay? At least to this line. Alright, let's so, let you guys in. I'm thinking about just like dumping it. Just sabotage him. Yeah, I think starting went first. If you spill something, you know you won't. I'm definitely gonna spill something. Three, two, one. <laughs> Everything was filled. We all knew there was no chance. It do be a little slippery now. 
seen a little uh, drip in there. It's a little wet. So Josh decided to sabotage, which honestly, I might have done the same thing. Jerry wasn't too excited about his challenge after that. Hold a plank for the entire and the freaking floors. <laughs> <laughs> that is a wet floor. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Oh, dang it. Oh, 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 You both suck. We have to do the final tiebreaker challenge. Pick it. Read it aloud. Make the best paper airplane. Behind me, Jared and Josh. Woo! This is the final challenge to see which team wins A team or team team. Three, two, one, go. Uh. I heard some tires spin right Maybe. there. I smell them. Turn. Let's turn. Let's turn. Jay, it looks like he's got a few. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, I wish my wings were long. You know what? It's going like that. Oh, shoot. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh. oh, dude, I finished just in time. Star Rip is freaking dying back there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sick. Valiant. I, I, I'm so sick. You look really Three, two, one. <laughs> yeah! After Jared brought home the win for his team, he gave a heartwarming speech to everybody. But no matter how good the speech was, it was time to punish the losing team. Once I shut this door, you can't see anything. And you see that camera Colby's holding? That's an infrared camera. I did not want this to be easy for him, so this was going to be the fastest couple laps I did. And big shout out to Colby being in there because I almost threw up last night. Oh, man. Oh, crap. Oh, God. Oh, God. Holy crap. And now I'm sliding, now I'm sliding, now I'm sliding. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, 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 How was you guys' experience in the pitch black? Honestly, it was like, fun. It, was so it was a lot of fun. With that, it is a wrap. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, turn on post notifications. I post a video every Monday, 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Let's go! Yeah!